What is up, guys, and welcome back to another video of Frappuccino Sports. Well, I guess it's, it's kind of my first video. Um, but today we're going to be doing a Airsoft unboxing, or I guess you could say unbagging. Um, I know what's in here, and I've checked it out, um, but I haven't um, taken this out or opened it. That's going to be completely new to you and me. Um, one of the, the, I got all of this stuff from evike.com, and yeah, so let's get into it. We'll start with this. This is the first, the thing that I already know what it is, um, and this is the um, Elite Force 1911 TAC um, Complete Barrel Assembly, because my um, 1911 TAC uh broke in the barrel because I was being stupid and um, tried to take off a mock suppressor by tightening it. And this little metal piece right here just bent right off. Or, no, it's on this side. That metal piece bent right off and then I had to go in there and fix it. But, um, yeah, that's the first thing and that comes out at $20, I think? Yeah, 20 bucks. Um, so now let's get into the big thing. Oh, here it is. So, um, one of these things is like an add-on to another one. So I'll start with the first thing. So these are the Valken Tactical um, Tango Thermal Goggles. They are... Um, Really nice goggles that, um, ooh, nice little carrying case here. Um, what, from what I've read, they're really nice goggles, and they're really good for anti-fogging. Is that backwards for you guys? I don't know. Um, but Valken Tactical Tango Thermal Lens Goggles. Um, there's some really nice goggles here. There's all the specs if you want to check that out. It's got um, anti-fog thermal lenses there's three different ones there's a clear one yellow and a dark one so if you're playing out in the day clear is for like if you just want to have a clear vision um and yellow would be for like dawn and dusk so yeah it's got all kinds of different setups um got a kit carrying bag full seal all kinds of the stuff you need um these come out at forty dollars and yeah, they're nice little goggles, so let's set that to the side. So now we get into the good stuff. Um, I will go here next. These are the EMG Professional Training EVA foam plates. Um, they're in the... 9 by 12 inch, I think, and uh, there's one for the front and one for the back. There's two different plates there, um, and we're going to be using these soon. So, yeah, that's the next thing we have, and now we're going to move on to the big boy. Yep. So this, guys, this is the Matrix 600D Molly Plate Carrier, and the cool thing about this guy is it comes with a hydration carrier, and it's super cheap. This thing is only, like, 50 bucks. That's extremely cheap for a plate carrier with all of these functions. It's got three mag pouches for M4s. And um, I think you can double stack these. And it also has pistol mag pouches on it. So you get three pistol mag pouches. And I think you can double stack M4 mags in here. Um, so six M4 mags, three pistol mags, a hydration carrier, and a plate carrier. And it only rounds out at $50. So this is an amazing bang for your buck. Um, you can... 
It's got the two straps on the side. It's got this nice adjustable top straps. This is just an amazing, oh, and I forgot to mention this, it comes with a belt. So if you don't already have a belt, personally I have one, but you're getting so much stuff. I would really suggest this for a beginner plate carrier. Um, and I think I forgot to mention, but this rounded out at um, 12 bucks. And these should be able to fit in here. Um, these are, this is 12 bucks, and this is $48. So with shipping, you're probably only going to be spending like $70 for a nice plate carrier and a nice plates for that plate carrier. Um, all of this stuff rounds out with the goggles, the plates, the plate carrier, and the new barrel for my 1911 um, rounds out at about $120, I think. And with um, shipping and handling, it should be like $150. Um, but that is the unboxing part of this. I think I'm going to put the plates in the plate carrier and put my barrel into my 1911 and tell you guys how it looks. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we're back. Um, so I put the barrel in my 1911. I got a little cat sticker there if you didn't notice. Um, and I put the barrel in and it is silver. So it looks really, really nice on my silver 1911. Um, as you can see, it's silver in there, not black. That, um, that was one of the things that r really bothered me because I got the silver 1911, but there was so much black on it, it didn't feel like a, a silver 1911. Like, the trigger, this hammer, the safety, the beaver tail safety, even the grips were black. Um, and I thought that if they're, like, that just always bothered me. I thought that they could have made the trigger silver, the hammer silver, the sight silver. Um, maybe the grips um, weren't that important, but still, I think that um, the silver parts of my 1911 always bothered me. The black parts on my silver 1911 always bothered me. But now that there's a silver barrel in there, it looks really nice. And nice and polished and clean. So, there is the barrel. And as you can see, I'm wearing the plate carrier. It's a nice plate carrier. And yes, I was right, it can hold two M4 magazines double stacked. Um, so, one, two. Um, two double stacked magazines. It has enough space to hold an AK magazine. Um, I have this for my AK-47. Um, again, two M4 magazines. If you're a sniper running a uh, plate carrier, I don't know why, just get a chest rig, but it will hold most sniper magazines. Um, the pistol mags work fine with my 1911 TAC mags. Um, I've got a bunch of space in there, wiggle room. Um, I haven't tried with a extended mag. Yeah, you can't put an extended pistol mag in there. Um, but the plates in here are really rigid, nice, and padded. I'm definitely not going to get hurt by any uh, BBs. And on the back, they're nice and fine. This plate carrier fits me fine, and I am a 13-year-old child. Um, and I'm on the smaller side of the 13-year-old children. So if you are a small person, the Matrix 600D uh, nylon a uh, plate carrier would be perfect for you. But one thing I did notice that I don't really like about this plate carrier is um, there's no morale patch space. I really like putting morale patches on my plate carriers. I just, um, I, I've only had one tactical vest and it was the NC Star tra child vest. It was only like 26 bucks. It couldn't hold plates or anything. It zipped up, but the one thing I really did like about that is I had like six inches of um, Velcro space for my morale patches, but this has none. I'm sure you could get something um, that was molly webbed that you could put on here with um, space on it for morale patches, but 
it's just that's one of my main letdowns but other than that it's almost perfect it has a hydration carrier i haven't filled it with water yet um and this belt um i adjusted it so it would fit me but i'm sure it would work fine for a weapon belt just have a holster hanging down there um but yeah this is a nice plate carrier and um matrix is one of the oh i'm gonna say budget brands like they make nice stuff decent quality stuff and have it for a very very decent price um most of their stuff is not again the highest quality but it gets the job done and it works this is the matrix plate carrier it was only 50 bucks it holds plates it's a plate carrier it carries plates got plenty of molly room i got three mag pouches each hold two m4 mags so six m4 mags plus one in the gun that's plenty of ammo um it's got that covered if you're also running a pistol secondary you can have three pistol mags plus one in the gun that's plenty of ammo for your pistol and if you're going to milsim games this um hydration carrier should get you covered through most of it i think it holds two liters which is quite a bit if you think about it um but yeah it's got velcro i mean clips there so you can take that part off and clips here to take it off there and then from there you just take this velcro off and then put the plates in there these were the um emg plates that i got and i put in there and they're not very flexible like for me they don't curve to my body perfectly but it doesn't um restrict movement that much like anything you wear will restrict movement to an extent but um this just does not um do it very much like i can still move down and squat when i have this plate carrier on so overall i say this is a great um plate carrier the Matrix 600D Molly plate carrier. Um, if you just search 600D on your um, on evike.com, this is the only thing that comes up. And these uh, plates seem to work fine. They fit in this plate carrier fine. I think they're nine by 12 inch. I think I said that already. Um, this holds nine by 12 inch plates. I, think it's got a little bit more space but i wouldn't go any taller than 12 inches but it still has two or three inches on the sides um overall again i think it's just a great plate carrier and some great plates the this barrel it does, does what i need it to do it's a barrel and it works and these goggles i haven't actually tried them in any games yet but I've heard they're really, really good, and I would suggest them. I think you can get them on Amazon used for, like, $22. They go for $40 retail. Um, but everything we have here is um, $120 in total. Add in shipping and handling, it's like $150. But, um, yeah, that's my $150 haul. And so, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.